speaking of that, let's bring our hands to our heart, taking in a conscious breath or two, filling your heart center. <sighs> and just sending a signal to your body to relax and trust whatever is supporting you right now, standing or sitting, to trust that. Open your heart and feel a wave of unconditional love emanating through you. Through you. Relax and receive the wisdom and the love. Oh. Hello, beloved ones. Hello, beloved ones. We are all here today. We are all here for you. We do this. We do this. We are all here. You may say, who are the all? We say we are the all, the unified stream of divine, blessed bounty of ascended energy. The unified stream of divine bounty of all this blessed energy is yours now, is yours now. We allow for thee to connect directly with the broader energy because to come in as an individual in voice or an individual in expression only perpetuates individual and in the individual is great expression and in the individual is great momentum and in the individual is a beautiful blessing and when the individual relaxes into the divine blessing of the wholeness of crystalline nature then the individual relaxes ever more and the smile of the infinite comes forward. This smile of the infinite begins deep within the physical form. It comes into the physical form like a gentle mother in the night checking on a child. And the gentle mother comes in to the room, checks on the child. Perhaps this child had a fever during the day and the fever prevented the child from remembering the truth of who they are. Prevent, pre prevent, we have so many words, let us take a moment. Yes, the fever presented a prevention of divine memory. Do you have a fever? Do you have chills? Do you notice that when you have a fever, there is a preoccupation with the fever and a sense to go deeply within. And that when a fever that is so hot comes into the body, you become so hot, you no longer feel heat and chills come forward. A shaking that says, give me more to take me within. Give me a blanket, help me feel comfortable. Let me snuggle here in my bed. And as you slumber, and as you snuggle, perhaps in the middle of your evening journey of slumber, your beautiful sacred mother tiptoes in, gently strokes your hair, checks your forehead, and whispers, I love you. I love you. All is well. And in the morning, when the child awakes, there is a sense of comfort. This is the smile that comes from the greater relaxation of the individual will into the divine crystalline nature that expresses. When the fever is gone, the body is restored because that fever has offered to the body the moment of connection with a flame of transmutation. 
To have a fever is to burn that which has caused the imbalance. To burn away that which has caused imbalance. This is indeed the transmuting energy of all sacred flame energy. There are some who say, I ignite a violet flame. There are some who say, I ignite a golden flame. There are some who say, I ignite a crystalline flame. There are some who say, I bring the passionate flame of the orange into the solar plexus of the form to burn and transmute the drama, the chaos, the disbelief, that which has caused the fever, the fever of density, the fever that leads to the chills, the fever that eventually brings you back to yourself. You see, beloved ones, as we are all here with you now, it does not matter which flame you use. What matters is you use it. Perhaps there is an emerald flame of divine, healing, restorative energy around you. Use them. Use them all. Call them. Command them all. For this is your luxurious, purposeful, comforting, soft, gentle, loving nature. Review those words again and you may say, why luxurious? For this may bring to you a sense of misunderstanding. Luxurious energy is the energy that allows you to fully relax without the perception of want or need. This is why this term has been so misunderstood on your planet. There are those who look at the luxurious comfort and say how extravagant, how non-spiritual, how incorrect. Beloved one, consider the luxury of placing thy feet in soft mud. Consider the luxury of simply knowing that the body is feeling safe and comfortable. Consider the luxury of knowing that regardless of whether your head is on a pillow or the grass, there is the luxury of the comfort of the divine connection. To be in the luxurious state is to say to the universe, thank you, I am fulfilled. Thank you, the smile has illuminated deep within and has come forward now as a radiant knowing, the ever presence in the eyes, that smile, the mouth, that nose, the ears, that hear, the heart that is soft and the strength of the divine incarnate, in presence, in action, in deed. Breathe, beloved ones. If a fever has been upon thee, then allow this fever to burn. Call, call. Call, command, command the flames, command them all. Simply say, all of the flames of transmutation that serve the highest release of this fever of the densified realm are now available to me, to this form, to this individual. Feel that gift radiate and illuminate through thee. Illuminate up. Gaze now at the tips of our fingers and see all the colors that are radiant, all of them. Feel and see these radiant tips of light. Place them on the heart. Place them on the head. Let them radiate together. Allow these colors to swirl and then place them together and magnify, magnify, magnify and release. 
and as you do, and as you are healing, holy, knowing, the smile shall carry thee through, because the smile cannot ever be dimmed. The smile is without definition. We offer this word smile to you to call this in, to be radiant, to be illuminated, to feel the fever as a divine gift, to know without doubt that whenever you slumber, the Sacred Mother comes forward and whispers into you, I love you, all is well, and gently strokes your hair and gently checks your forehead and offers you the gift of another moment of connection. And so it is. We love you. We are here for you. Namaste.